That fez and vest combo is much too third century. These patches, what are we trying to say? Beggar? No. Let's work with me here. Ooh, I like it muy macho. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today, we're counting down our picks for the top 10 animated movie makeovers. Donkey, you're a... A stallion, baby! I can win it! <laughs> I can count! Look at me, Shrek! I'm trotting! For this list, we'll be looking at the biggest and best transformation and makeover scenes from our favorite animated movies. Which movie makeover would you like best? Tell us in the comments! Number 10. Elsa – Frozen As the eldest sibling and future queen, Elsa always had to be the sensible, responsible one. Her tied-back hair and high-necked gowns reflect this. She has her secret, too the powers that she's always been told to hide. Conceal, don't feel, put on a show, make one wrong move and everyone will know. That's why she covers up her hands with long, elegant gloves. But we all know by now that eventually Queen Elsa has to let it go. In the iconic transformation scene, she sheds her stifling layers and becomes the glamorous ice queen she's always been inside. She doesn't need to guard against icy weather or hide her true self when up in the mountains. She literally lets down her hair. Anna. <gasps> Whoa, Elsa, you look different. It's a good different. Her stuffy, ceremonial clothes become something more youthful, sparkling, and fun. Number 9. Rapunzel – Tangled Rapunzel's defining physical feature is her long, golden hair. It's what the story is all about, after all. But we quickly learn that her personality is even more special than her magical blonde tresses. Flower blooming glow, let your power shine, make the clock reverse, bring back once was mine. Hey, do it has been hurt, change your face design, say what has been lost, bring back oh. mine. Rapunzel. Entangled, her hair gets its first makeover when she visits the big city with Flynn. He spots a troop of little girls who are all too happy to braid it up for her. Rapunzel's flower plate is gorgeous, but her most radical makeover comes right at the end of the movie. I'll never run. I'll never try to escape. Just let me heal him, and you and I will be together. Forever, just like you want. Everything will be the way it was. When Flynn cuts her hair to save her from Mother Gothel, it turns brown and loses its power. But her new choppy cut looks great on her and is infinitely more practical. Rapunzel? <gasps> Eugene. Did I ever tell you I've got a thing for brunettes? Number 8. Hercules. Hercules. Despite being a demigod with superhuman strength, Hercules isn't the muscle-bound hero of legend when we first meet him. He starts the story as a stringy teenager with a reputation as a klutz. We already got five, and we want to keep it an even number. Hey, wait a second. Five isn't an See, even... Herc, what a geek. <laughs> Destructo boy. That all changes when he meets his mentor, Philoctetes. In a training montage set to one of the movie's catchiest songs, Phil gets Herc whipped into shape. I'm down to one less hope and I hope... It's you. No kid, you're not exactly a dream come true. His basic white tunic gets swapped out for some hero-worthy garb, since the farm boy look won't cut it in the big city. His new outfit involves a headband, armor, and some flashy new sandals. He's still the same naive kid, but he's starting to look the part. So, <laughs> did they give you a name along with all those rippling pectorals? Uh, uh, I, I'm, um... Uh, I, I, Are you always this articulate? Hercules. <laughs> Meg seems to think so anyway. Number 7. Woody. Toy Story 2. In the second Toy Story movie, Woody finds himself in the clutches of Al the toy collector, who steals him from the family yard sale. You, my little cowboy friend, are gonna make me big. Ba -ba -ba. Woody's arm is ripped, so Al brings in a professional to have him cleaned up. In the subsequent makeover montage, the cowboy gets the full treatment. So, uh, how long is this gonna take? You can't rush art. Propped up in a chair like he's at the barber's, his boots are shined and his eyes and ears are polished. They even get rid of his bald patch and put roses in his cheeks. 
Woody's especially pleased with his new muscular arm, with its little bit of extra padding. Oh wow, will you look at me? It's like I'm fresh out of the box! Look at this stitching! Eddie's gonna have a hard time ripping this! Hello! Hi! Hello! Great! Now you can go! The only sad note is the final touch, when Andy's name is painted over on Woody's boot. Number 6. Anastasia. Anastasia. In this beloved movie musical, we follow Anya the orphan, a girl from St. Petersburg with no memory of her past. Anya. Anya. It's Anya. Just, it's just that you look an awful lot like... <laughs> Uh, never mind. Um, now, you said something about travel papers. When her path collides with conman Dimitri, she agrees to follow him to Paris to play the part of the lost princess Anastasia. I don't remember who I am, then who's to say I'm not a princess or a duchess or whatever she is, right? Mm-hmm. Go on. Yeah, and if I'm not Anastasia, the Empress will certainly know right away, and it's all just an honest mistake. On the boat to France, she first discards her familiar coat and raggedy dress, but her makeover isn't yet complete. In Paris, she gets dressed up to go out on the town. But it's not until the Russian ballet that the real wow moment happens. Sophie wants to take us shopping for the ballet! Shopping in Paris, can you believe it? In her dark blue evening dress with her hair up, Anya takes Dimitri's breath away. She's not yet proved her identity, but she already looks the part. Number 5. Aladdin. Aladdin. When Aladdin, a poor boy from the streets of Agrabah, comes into the possession of a magic lamp, the world is his oyster. So, with his first official wish, he asks the genie to make him a prince in order to win the heart of Princess Jasmine. Can you make me a prince? Oh, let's see. Chicken a la king? <laughs> what? No. Yeah, that's king, king crab. I hate it when they do that. Caesar salad. <laughs> At du no. Basically, he gets a makeover. Robin Williams has a lot of fun with the following scene, in which Genie becomes a fashion guru. Aladdin's fez and vest combo is replaced with an outfit fit for royalty. You remind me of someone I met in the marketplace. The marketplace? <laughs> uh, I have servants who go to the marketplace for me. In the blink of an eye, the so-called street rat is transformed into the fabulous Prince Ali. But his new look is not quite radical enough to keep his true identity from the woman he loves. You are the boy from the market. I knew it. Why did you lie to me? Jasmine, I I'm sorry. Did you think I was stupid? No. That I wouldn't figure it out? No, I, I mean... I, I hoped you wouldn't. Number 4. Mulan. Mulan. Mulan gets two radical makeover moments at the beginning of her movie. Is this what you give me to work with? Well, honey, I've seen worse. We're gonna turn this sow's ear into a silk purse. In the first, she's transformed into the archetypal perfect bride, ready for her trip to the matchmaker. She's primped and polished, her face is painted, and she's dressed up in her best. She may look perfect, but she knows, and so it seems does everyone else, that this isn't who she really is. When will my reflection show who I am inside? Her second makeover is the big one. In order to save her father from death in the army, she cuts her hair and disguises herself as a boy. As Fa Ping, she's playing another part. It's not until the end of the movie that she's able to be her authentic self. You. You took away my victory. No. I did. Number 3. Shrek and Donkey. Shrek 2. The original Shrek movie ends with Fiona's transformation into an ogre. When she kisses Shrek, she takes love's true form. I don't understand. I'm supposed to be beautiful. But you are beautiful. In the sequel, the tables are turned. Shrek takes a happily ever after potion in order to become the man he believes his wife needs him to be. You and your true love. If one of you drinks this, you both will be fine happiness, comfort, and beauty divine. But when he and Donkey drink the potion, they're not sure how things will turn out. How do you feel? Well, I don't feel any different. I look any different? You still look like an ass to me. 
Shrek wakes up in a barn, surrounded by women with a crush. This is new for the ogre, as civilians usually take one look at him and run for the hills. When he discovers his newfound attractiveness, he doesn't know how to feel about it. Wow, that potion worked on you too, huh? Uh, what potion? Oh, it's kind of a long story, but see, Shrek and I took some magic potion, and well, now we're sexy! Donkey, on the other hand, is thrilled. Number 2. Isabella, Encanto Out of the three sisters in Encanto, Isabella begins the movie as the least sympathetic. But we learn that there's more to her than meets the eye. I've been stuck being perfect my whole entire life, and literally, the only thing you have ever done for me is mess things up! Nothing is messed up! She's always felt the need to present as pristine and perfect. But beneath the surface, there's a fun, colorful Isabella just waiting to break free. During the song, What Else Can I Do?, she discovers that she's only been accessing part of her talent. What could I do if I just knew it didn't need to be perfect? It just needed to be, and it let me be. She can conjure not just roses and feminine florals, but imperfect, unusual things too. As she and Mirabel sing their way through this light bulb moment, Isabella gets messy. Her clothes become covered in splashes of color, and so does her hair. Her new look may not be perfect, but it is perfect for her. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Cinderella, Cinderella Cinderella's pre-ball transformation was a favorite scene of Walt Disney himself. It still stands up as the House of Mouse's most magical makeover moment. You can't go to the ball looking like that. The ball? Oh, but I'm not. Of course you are. But we'll have to hurry because even miracles take a little time. Just as in the original fairy tale, Cinderella's fairy godmother appears to her on the eve of the ball and turns her rags to riches. The scene is beautifully animated and atmospheric. Just leave it to me, what a gown this will be! The dress itself is still one of the most stunning ever worn by a Disney princess. There have been multiple incarnations of Cinderella, and the fairy godmother always works her magic. On the stroke of twelve, the spell will be broken, and everything will be as it was before. Oh, I understand, but it's more than I ever hoped for. But this animated 50s classic will always be the most iconic. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.